Hello friends, welcome to AI Flux. So today is especially exciting because we just got another update to the Falcon LLM that comes from the UAE's Technology Innovation Institute. It's pretty wild. So at this point, this is the world's largest and most powerful open model. So Falcon 180B is the next iteration of the Falcon 70B LLM that was released just a few months ago. And the 180 corresponds to 180 billion training parameters and 3.5 trillion tokens that were used to create this model. And there are actually some really interesting attributes here. The biggest is that not only does this just barely perform better than the Llama 2 LLM released by Meta just a few weeks ago, but it performs exceptionally well in non-English languages, which makes sense because the UAE predominantly does not speak English, they speak Arabic. So after studying the world with Falcon 40B, that at the time of its release was among the most powerful base models ever trained. They've really done it again. And uh, again, I think calling it the most powerful open source model to date is kind of interesting. But uh, there are some other interesting attributes here that I also want to cover. Basically, it's the best right now. It's not wildly better, but uh, in terms of the Hugging Space Open LLM leaderboard, this shows that it's uh, compared to Falcon 40B, Llama 2, and MPT 30B, kind of as a base. Uh, Falcon 180B is now the top dog in all of this. And what's really cool is you can actually uh, do QLoRa tuning with just two A100s. And uh, clearly this is kind of a hefty model, so it's upping the ante in terms of the compute necessary. Um, but these are solidly um, GPU poor numbers. So of course, so it's curious whether or not I would call the uh, UAE Technology Innovation Institute GPU poor or GPU rich. GPU rich in the fact that they just created a model faster than um, Meta's Llama 2. However, it is kind of interesting because now that Nvidia as of next week will no longer be able to export the A100 or the H100 GPUs to uh, the UAE, you have to wonder if uh, they're really still GPU rich or if they're now GPU poor since they're gonna have to start scrounging for GPUs like the rest of us on vast.ai. And um, to be frank, it's kind of wild. Uh, sometimes Falcon 70B initially was pretty careful with how it wrote. And uh, the hilarious thing is you can actually get pretty wild things out of it. So for instance, this, this one came out with bleep, algorithmic norms, and their bland sanitized aesthetics. It's time to break free from our machine and unleash our wild unconventional sides, which is pretty wild for uh, the UAE. And uh, we won't let algorithms dictate our tastes, our identities, our, or our creativity. Let's reject conformity, embrace rebellion, and create a future where diversity reigns supreme. Well, that took a wild turn at the end there, uh, and then it says hashtag digitally rebellious. So uh, I might try to write some tweets with this, that would be kind of interesting. But curiously enough, this is the Hugging Face leaderboard. So we're not really sure if this will be uh, usable if for commercial use. However, um, yeah, clearly better than Llama, Llama 2, and Falcon 70B. And one of the bigger things that I find interesting here is why this model is actually better at non-English languages. And we can hope for a technical report soon so we understand why, but right now we know that basically it has 2.5 times the number of parameters of Llama 2, um, 1.7x the data model. You can generally assume that that will give you better performance. What's curious here is if whether or not the data set is heavily multilingual and whether or not those tokens are coming from English and then being transposed, or if those tokens are coming from Arabic and then being used to train. And this is the page itself. So what's really cool with these models as well is you can download them right now. And there are also active spaces on Hugging Face and a few other platforms. So if you have eight A100s and you wanna start um, fine tuning, or if you just wanna run this on a GPU for inference, there's some really curious GPU combinations to actually do this. They actually have a demo running on their site right now. So let's try this out. All right, so we're in the Hucking Face space now. And I should also mention that what's cool is Facebook has kind of set a standard here in that a lot of these new LLMs are coming out with sort of base model and then a base chat model, which I think is pretty cool. And I'm really hoping that soon enough, we'll see if we see a coding model come out of this. I'm not really sure that we'll see it, but uh, let me try something here. All right, so this is the chat model. So, hi, I'm an AI YouTuber. Which video should I make next? Let's see. Oh, and it's fast. Okay. Okay, that's not very helpful, but this is pretty quick. Let's see, I want to write better titles. Could you suggest some titles for a video about Falcon 180B? And let's see, maybe, maybe we'll use one of these, maybe we won't. 
So interesting. It thinks Falcon 180B is a drone. That's kind of funny. Crashing and recovering your Falcon 180B, a troubleshooting guide. All right. Uh, I'll try one of these two. So let's see. Um, we'll do something with that's more prose. And granted, this is English. So in theory, it's good at this, but it's also much better at other languages. Interesting. Okay. So we're getting some information about electron spin here, which is kind of cool. Let's do this one here. These suggested examples are quite good. They're all pretty different, and this is sort of sports. And what's cool is it's not getting too caught up on prior contexts here. I want, some LLMs are good at that, some really aren't. Deep water soloing has become increasingly popular in recent years, especially in places like Mallorca, Spain. Okay. Well, this is pretty cool. So yeah, I just wanted to make a quick video about this. I think this is going to set another standard in terms of performance. I really hope we see a coding model derived from this quite soon. And uh, yeah, and what's also cool here is they say, okay, the, the demo is powered by Falcon 180B in a fine tune on a mixture of Alter Chat, Platypus, Iroboros, Falcon, and, okay. So it's a mixture, again, brought to you by the Technology Innovation Institute in Abu Dhabi. Uh, okay, interesting, interesting. So as always, uh, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. We hope you learned something and we'll see you in the next video.